Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I am back with another blazing fast Tinkercad project. So let's get cracking. Of course, we are going to start in Tinkercad. We're going to hit new and choose 3D design. Friends, I am a fan of the trophies that users are giving each other. I've also got a real easy way for you to make your very own trophy case. So I'm going to name this trophy case, and I'm going to put tutorial. You could put your name after it. So everybody, we're going to go to search and I'm going to tell you to type grid. When you type in grid, you need to check them out. We want this one right here that is orange. It has parameters. I'm going to tell you the number we want is one. I'm going to choose to have four rows. You could have more. The maximum size we can pick is 10 and I'm going to set the gap between them to one. I'm not going to mess with the height. I'm going to make them a hole. And then, friends, I'm going to stand them up and down. Notice when you're rotating, if you stay close to the shape or inside that blue circle, it snaps 22 and a half degrees at a time. If you move outside, it goes one degree at a time. Once I get it to 90 degrees, we're going to press D to drop. Now we can cheat. I want to make this trophy case wider. I'm going to tell you that I want to make mine 80. I'm also going to take the height and I'm going to make it 100. That is going to be how large my trophy case is. Friends, now we're going to pull it out a little further. I'm going to tell you I want to make that 25. I'm going to go back to the main shapes and let's grab a box. Friends, this is so slick. We can just type the numbers we want. Remember we used 25? So I'm going to do 28. So I'll have a gap of three. If we check our measurements this way, see how that was 80? So I'm going to do 80 plus 3 on each side, which would be 86, and type it in. And then finally, remember that the entire shape was 100 high. I am going to go 106 up so I can put 3 on each side. Now, friends, if I do a line, make the red one the boss. We want it centered. We want it to the front. And then we want it in the middle. Bingo. You have just made an amazing trophy case. How cool is that? I'm going to set it to a brown color because that's what I'd like my trophy to be. You can add words to this. You can add all kinds of amazing things to it. But what I really want you to do is add your own trophy to it. All right, everybody. So I've quickly went to my The Roar account. You can see I've got my little Lions logo over there. And it's time to get my first trophy. Friends, to get your first trophy, what I recommend is simply click search and in the search box type golden rule when you do you should see the free like before you copy trophy friends the rule is always give somebody a like before you copy and tinker the design when you have then you can copy and tinker the design respectfully simply hit copy and tinker and the design will open now you can play with adjust and learn so much from this process and then also today you can copy your design by simply clicking the copy button and then switch back to your trophy case friends with it copied i want to put it right here so i'm going to put the work plane where i want to put it if you do control v bingo you've got the trophy in I'm going to hold down shift and shrink it to the size that fits. If we do F to fit view, you can zoom in and see if it's exactly how you want. I can stretch it a little bit larger and bingo, work plane back on the ground. And bingo, you've got a trophy case and a trophy. How sweet is that? All right, friends, so let's run through this again. Super cool skills to make instant bookshelves or a trophy case, and then also highlighting the like before you copy trophy. Friends, of course, if you found this video useful, please give it a like. Please also hit that share button so more people can learn about HL Mod Tech. Of course, friends, don't forget you absolutely make my day if you take time to leave a comment down below. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button, and last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.